Julian Hernandez was just five years old when police say his father didn't drop him off at preschool in August 2002. Instead, they said Bobby Hernandez withdrew money from multiple bank accounts, took some of the boys' clothes and toys, and left town. There was not a custody arrangement at that point. Under the law, when there is no specific custody, custody arrangement, the law treats both parents as having custody of the child. But um, my understanding is primary care was, was with mom. After 13 years of searching, a break in the case from FBI agents in Cleveland, Ohio, Julian was found. In 25 years of doing this job, this is the first time that I've ever come across anything quite like this. FBI agents in Ohio say Julian and his father were not using their real names. Our uh, violent crime task force worked this matter over the weekend and in fact confirm that it is Julian Hernandez. The FBI has not released details on how he was located, but he was found at a house in Cleveland, and his father, Bobby Hernandez, was taken into custody. Police notified Julian's mother on Monday. She was excited, relieved, and uh, just, um, you know, express, I can't express it in words. Investigators believe the two have already been in contact. It's extremely distressing. Uh, to know that a parent was, was without her child for so long, not knowing where her child was, uh, what was going on. Jefferson County District Attorney Brandon Fall says Bobby Hernandez could face two charges here, interference with custody and identity theft.